Hello and welcome back to your own channel Indian Defense Analysis where we bring to you all the latest development happening in the defense sector. Insas or Indian Small Arms System is family of small arms in 5.56 by 45 mm caliber. The family of weapons include rifle, light machine gun, carbine and its ammunition and accessories. In 1994, the decision was taken to induct the weapon into Indian Armed Forces. Since then, it has been almost three decades and INSAS is still holding the ground in Indian Armed Forces. Approximately 20 lakh rifles, 600 crore ammunition and 1 lakh LMG have been procured and supplied to security forces. The one concern that has been there was with the lethality of 5.56 by 45 mm caliber as the rules of engagement has changed in last three decades. The armed forces are now not looking to injure but shoot to kill. The new bulletproof race among the terrorists and militants have further increased the demand for a more lethal round. While the AK-203 production is yet to kickstart, like it or not, NSAS is going to be with security forces for another five years at least. In the lights of the same, DRDO has decided to develop a new and more lethal ammunition for the NSAS to inflict more damage. The laboratory enhanced lethality of 5.56 mm ball ammunition being used in NSAS rifle for the close quarter ranges 200 meters to 300 meters. The profile and internal construction of new ammunition has been changed by ARDE and developed by AFK Pune. If you closely compare both the rounds, the old INSAS rounds has overall length of 7.4 mm and the new round has slightly more length of 60 mm. Indian Army has conducted the trials of the new ammo and the result can be seen on the screen. The difference is clearly visible between both the rounds and new INSAS rounds clearly seems to be causing more damage on 10% ordnance grade guillotine. The new ammunition has met all the technical parameters of INSAS ammunition and is all set to be fired from INSAS weapons. Apart from lethal round, the under barrel grenade launcher has also been developed for INSAS to boost its firepower and effectiveness of INSAS rifle and provide grenade firing capability up to 400 meter range. The UBGL fires 40 mm by 46 mm HE, HEDP, and RP smoke rounds common with multiple grenade launcher. It can also be attached with AK 47 rifle owing to its modular design. The UBGL follows pump action along with conventional extractor. The breech loading enables easy loading and unloading of the ammunition. Ordnance Factory Trichy is the production agency for the UGBL and approximately 20,000 UBGLs are in service. This was today's update. Please let us know what is your views about these in comment section. Feel free to post your comments and suggestions about any topic related to defense sector on which you want to hear from us. With this, I would like to say goodbye and Jai Hind friends. Please like and subscribe our video if you have not done already. We will be soon back with more interesting and amazing development happening in defense sector.